from the bottom of my heart, you guys. Thank you so much. Thank you for watching. For watching this guy's channel. No, Jody's like channel. Jody's Corner. No. My favorite. Thank you so much. <laughs>
Why? Because it's popular to freaking expose this trash Star Wars for what it is now? Or do you really understand that this freaking film is filth? I don't know. You, I don't know if you're telling the truth and being honest, or if you're just riding the wave. You're riding the mother freaking wave is what it is. <sighs> I'm sorry. This film has... I have to review this. I'm sorry. I, I apologize for that. I just wanted to get a little bit out. I'm sorry. Whew, I can't wait for the rant. I can't. I cannot wait for Friday. The spoilers. Spoiler free. Here we go. Um. So we we're we're, we're here and we're following along after the events of the Last Jedi. The rebellion is still fighting the good fight to somehow defeat Kylo Ren's. Uh. First Order, because since we know that in Last Jedi, Snoke was defeated and murdered, killed, assassinated by Kylo Ren, and he is now Supreme Leader Kylo, he's the he's the dude now, so, okay, so now Rey has decided to still roll with her rebels, and now we have Kylo over there, Rey over there, and then the clash is going to happen, They're, they have to figure out how to, you know, Rey wants to convert Kylo to the, to the, to the light, how they call it now, and Kylo wants to convert Rey to the dark side. These are the intentions that we got from The Last Jedi, and they're more so here. Uh, the rebel fleet is trying to re uh, re uh, get as much as it can in order to continue fighting the good fight. As we all know, it's classic Star Wars cliche. We always know there's always some shit going on, and it's normal. You guys understand. And then we have the journey of ray going forth trying to figure out how to convert kylo kylo chasing ray to convert her and that's really what this is about it's about converting one to the one side and one to the other like what all star wars movies are for the most part about god dang my dog is sick you can hear him throwing up back there i apologize for you know he pills and all that so that's what this is really about and we see that we have the a cliche type god dang simple a cliche type of story it's the wreckage that happens. The characters themselves do not grow. The character development is non-existent. As far as developing a character from where they once were to a, an, an heightened stance and seeing them go through ups and downs to a certain level, we don't see that. We just see more of the same from Ray, from Kylo, foe, pin and foe, foe and pin. Oh my god. Poe and Finn! Gosh! Poe and Finn are bromancers. They're doing their thing on the side. They don't really matter. This really much more focuses on light and dark. Uh, the Jedi, the Sith. And it's about converting each other. And it, it takes you... This film uses... So much exposition to the point where it's so cluttered with mess. And the only way that this film can be moving forward is by this incredible amount of exposition. Meaning, in order for me to catch the viewer up, I'm going to let this two minute sequence happen to catch us up. Oh, I have to get from there to there? Exposition. We're going to get from there to there. Exposition. The story just jumps so much, so fast, just to get to a certain part that you know that the writer wanted to start to telling you the story of. The exposition in the beginning of the film was ridiculous. The first 15 minutes of this movie has a ridiculous amount of exposition. It feels like you... You've gotten, you've gotten a whole, you could, you could literally put an entire movie in the first 15 minutes of the Rise of Skywalker film. Legitimately, that would have been an episode in the old trilogy. In the original trilogy, the first 15 or 20 minutes of Rise of Skywalker would have been a movie. I'm not lying. The prequels. I know a whole episode of a prequels movie would have been in that first 20 minutes and they expedited, expedited the shit out of it quick. And that's the feeling you get of this movie. There's so much 
epic. It is epic. I can't lie. But here's the kicker. It's the wrong epic. It is the bad epic. Epic can be terrible too. It, this is terribly epic. This movie is terribly epic. It takes everything that you know, everything that you love about Star Wars, everything you were taught about Star Wars, watching the movies from the original trilogy, if so, the prequels, if so, and this new, no, this new shit don't count. Everything that you probably watched, read about Star Wars, it takes that, it spits on it, it freaking throws it, and flaming arrows it, and it watches it rain down disintegration. Out the freaking window. And I thought Last Jedi was that. I'm going to tell you 100%. I got to save so much of this for the spoiler review. This is just to let you guys know what y'all going to walk into. This is a, a terrible film. Let's get that off the, off the rock. How bad of a film is this though? <sighs> oh, there's so much I want to say. There's so much I want to talk about. Oh, I don't even know what the point of it is doing. I know the point of doing spoiler free because I want to get the word out. I know. The spoiler, the spoiler review is where it's at. The spoiler, I. This film is really, really bad. It is, it is, the, the Last Jedi, Ryan Johnson sucks. And I remember so many people saying, we need JJ back. Yeah. And I remember listening to them. In my comment section on Twitter, bring back JJ. Yeah, yeah. I want JJ back. He can fix it. His original plan was great. No, it wasn't. JJ's trash too. And I told y'all that. Y'all want JJ back? What JJ gonna do? What JJ gonna do? JJ sauce, bro. He's sauce. Now it's arguable who's worse, JJ or Ryan. The answer is JJ. The Last Jedi is better than this movie. It's better. How am I saying? How am I saying that? How? 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 It's freaking true. I rather watch. Fucking believe. I can't believe I. I would rather watch the Last Jedi. That filth, scum, farce of the movie. Now watch Rise of Skywalker. Rise of Skywalker is worse than The Last Jedi. This shit. This film is worse than The Last Jedi. It's a nightmare. I can't believe... Where they took this? J.J. Abrams, what rock pipe is you smoking? What did Kathleen do to you to make you do this shit? How? What? What the? F what happened? What happened? Embrace me. T tell me. Write me a letter. What is going on? What happened? What's going on over there? What, what are they doing? What are they sacrificing? What are they burning over there? What were you thinking when you made this shit? Ray, Daisy Ridley, what? Uh, uh, Adam Driver. I, I understand. I understand why you forgot the name of Last Jedi, but my my bro, I don't even fault you for this, bro. I know you're a good actor. But, bro, what happened? I'm on my Ricky Ricardo shit. What happened? You know what What happened? What happened? That's it. They took it there. They took it there. Some of the specific things in this movie that I tell you if you haven't seen this movie will blow your shit back. I'll see you guys for the spoiler review. I, I need to, I need to, I need to rest. I need to lie down. I feel like I'm going to turn into a freaking force ghost right now. I feel like I'm about to loot Skywalker and be about this beach. I feel like I'm going to faint away. I'll give this an F minus.
if this if this means anything to you do not pay for this movie this don't deserve a billion this don't deserve a m this movie doesn't deserve a hundred million fifty million this doesn't deserve a million dollars let alone a billion please stand up with me and not don't go see this i use free credit free credit free ticket i didn't pay See something else? Watch it too much. Trash too much. Watch that shit. Watch the rock. Watch little Kevin Hart be do flips and tricks. Go watch. Watch that. You'll be able to see this. You'll be able to see it. It'll come your way. Don't trip. There's lots of ways for you to see this without seeing it in the theater. You know what I'm saying? Like in the, you can wait for a video on demand, or wait for DVD or 4K to release. There's other ways to see it. I'm Jody Joe, and I'm out this thing. Deuces.